welcome today we're gonna do another video on how to test the voltage coming out of any receiver it can be a top fuel 3000 such as this one it could be a geosat pro 1200 or even an hdvr 3500 receiver how what you're gonna need is a regular paper clip like this one right here a metal paper clip and no plastic on it what I need you to do is just stretch it out just a little bit like that and we're going to take this end of the paper clip right here and we're going to going to insert it into the LMB input side this is this is the side that provides the power to the LMB and if you don't have a voltmeter what I recommend just just go to Harbor Freight and pick up a four dollar meter like this one put it on 20 volts DC and turn it on and what we're looking for is to make sure that your receiver is set on the horizontal polarity amazing facts 3 ABN I uh, hope channel doesn't matter we're going to take the black probe and tap the threads with the black probe and just hold it in place and in this case I, I'm missing the red end but the wire will work just fine We'll pay attention to the voltage. We should have at least 18 volts DC going to the LMB. If that is not present, uh, then the LMB is not going to operate. But if it is present, then most likely that we have an LMB as the culprit for no signal and no quality. So, and if you don't have any 18 volts coming out of the receiver, then uh, I would suspect that the power supply on your receiver has failed and it's time to get a new one. We are going to be changing from MPEG-4 technology to, I'm sorry, from MPEG-2 technology to MPEG-4. So if your receiver is bad, I would just recommend getting one of the new HDBR 3500s, which are MPEG-2 and MPEG-4 compatible. Thank you for watching. Please don't forget to subscribe and share with others. We appreciate your viewership. Bye-bye.